Where do you look when you're at the dentist? Or do you keep your eyes closed? My dentist has an aquarium screensaver fish tank screensaver gun RLC 1C1 GCU Enus 1022 S1023 Oak Roku fish tank G's LCRPX Yajabwik GCEH Iabdu Kakrak 5 Mkiara Gawi Gaki GCEH Iabdu CAM Kwabi GKG Iabdu Kiba Gawi Gaki VH Iabdu K Kwabi GKGB Ejin Kakabu Gishabu Kitin Kakabu Gishabu Kitin Kakabu Gishabu Oxnog Holica Source Eat Pro Me UTF 8th State IV LD said D9 A5174 A, Vid LKX G1 Y and Boo 4, a C0 on TVs above every chair. It is mesmerizing. I keep them closed and imagine I'm lying on a beach relaxing. Which is odd because in real life my rare attempts to lie on a beach and relax last about 25 seconds before I'm bored. I'm more of a play in the sea or do literally anything other than lie on a beach sort of person. So really it's keep my eyes closed and pretend I'm the sort of person who likes lying on a beach relaxing, while playing the imaginary sounds of waves lapping in my head. I always close my eyes when they are working on my teeth. I hate the feeling of hypochondriac brain, so I'm kinda worried that they will poke or cut my tongue, and I might panic and have to tell them my worries at every visit, by now they luckily know and are pretty chill about it and keeping my eyes closed help, together with having something to fidget with in my hands. The light they use is also quite bright. I usually just collapse into a weeping heap in the parking lot, require two office staff and my husband to corral me into the building, scrape at my skin and wail as I wait, stare at the Italian dentist's arm hair that connects with his knuckles and wait three hours for the ground up pills to knock me out while I sob and apologize to everyone and beg my husband to take me home. I just look up and away from the light. I spent a lot of my childhood at the dentist because I broke one of my front teeth in half which then caused a chain reaction of painful procedures to fix a root canal since I was so young. Then I had braces until right before I graduated. The dentist never bothered me because I was so used to it. I had the best dentist ever for this he had a camera installed on his mask that was live streaming on a TV in front of the patient. It does wonders knowing what's happening, what causes the different noises and which tool he uses next. I told him it was a really good idea. He told me it was how he made it into the business. Last couple times I was at the dentist I fell asleep because I was so tired from work. I had a root canal done and the second appointment was for the crown. The lady doctor that did the root canal let me sleep. The whole male doctor kept waking me up for the crown. I was only numb for the procedures, not put under. I close my eyes, I'm weird and going to the dentist is kind of meditative for me. I have ADHD and my mind doesn't stop racing. So being forced to sit still and not being able to talk just relaxes me. I close my eyes and eventually my mind just wanders off and quietens down. Even for a cleaning, I'm clenching the armrest, sweat dripping down my cheeks, making direct hypnotizing eye contact to ensure direct communication to the hygienist. It works great for communication and we have a silent conversation the entire time. I stare at the ceiling while clutching something in my hands. Last time it was a Percy Jackson book. I need some kind of emotional support object to death grip to keep from freaking out. I've been doing it ever since I was a child and I'm 21 now. My dentist started asking if patients want sunglasses to wear and let me just tell you it makes a huge difference in the amount of anxiety going to the dentist causes. It's like a mental shield between you and the horror that's taking place. I go to a sedation dentist because of anxiety so I get the laughing gas and just sort of doze. Honestly look forward to my cleanings now, feels like a spa. Tim Tim do recommend and this is from someone who didn't go to a dentist for 10 years. Are you crazy? Who would want to look at a giant sharp whirling thing being put into your mouth? Duh, not me. Do not, I repeat do not open your eyes ever during the appointment. Or there might be things you cannot unsee. At the TV they have on the roof of all the treatment rooms at my dental practice. Thought it was where to begin with but it certainly takes your mind off things after you get used to it. My dentist has a little mirror mounted at the lamp. I always look in the mirror. I want to know what's going on somehow the sounds and discomfort feels less when I see what causes them. I don't know but I got really, really excited about a TV show that he asked me about one time and I called him dude. Don't be like me and call your dentist dude. It's quite weird. My dentist is a asshole he inject not even half of the numbing stuff. So I obviously look right at him the whole time and I grab his hand etc if I feel it. Then he yells at me lol. I ask for the tinted eye protection, which at my dentist is basically just dollar store quality sunglasses, so my prescription glasses don't get all dirty, and close my eyes. Apparently lots of dentists have TVs on the ceiling. 
Unfortunately I just have a very angry looking man to look at and it always makes me so much more anxious. My dentist has posters on the ceiling. They're changed out monthly and they're always seasonally appropriate. It's the little thing that makes a big difference. Eyes closed, whole body tense. The dentist, poking a metal spike around my mouth you can relax. Me, around a mouthful of metal little. Urge. Mine has where's Waldo posters on the ceiling. I still haven't found all the fish and my vision is getting worse with age. I may never find it. I like to look at the ceiling, they usually have weird ceilings. Also at some point I forget them there and start daydreaming about other things. I stare at the ceiling intently. I also ask if they mind me having my earphone in because it helps with the anxiety. Usually they don't mind. I just keep watching the things he holds and when he uses the hand pieces I close my eyes and start thinking about anything. Crying face. I hate them. Crying face. My clinic has Netflix, so I listen to a show during my appointment. I usually close my eyes though. It feels weird to have them open. The ceiling. It's amazing how interesting it becomes to count ceiling cracks and dots when it's your only form of entertainment. Oddly, my hygienist likes to make conversation with me but it's extremely hard to converse back with her inside my mouth. Either straight up eye contact to assert dominance, or cross eye to make it weird. Depends on the day I suppose. I like to stare at the fluorescent light above me and play a fun game of how long will it take me to go blind at the TV. And I find it quite annoying when they finish the treatment 10 minutes before the end of the show. Mine has TVs up high they also are displays for looking at Zray's, but you get to watch cartoons or HGTV. My dentist has TVs mounted above the chair and plays Planet Earth for you or some other relaxing shit. I look at anything that'll distract me from the fact that Teresa and MF putting their hand in my mouth. I went yesterday. I think closed mostly, but went open, staring straight ahead. Minimal crying. Down her shirt and her tits and I always wear my gray sweat so she can see my huge cock bulge. Open, staring at a point away from the dentist's face, obviously. Why would you close them? Stare soullessly at the roof, panicking if I ever accidentally make eye contact with them. Close 99 of the time, the light they use is way too bright to keep my eyes open. I started wearing headphones and listening to podcast music with my eyes closed. They give tinted glasses to protect from splashes in their bright work lights. Stare at the bright ass light above me till my retinas are fucking obliterated. Mine has a screen on the ceiling with like nature scenery and stuff on it. My dentist office has flat screens on the ceiling so you can watch stuff. Closed. I sing Beatles songs in my head and before I know it, it's over. Look at the dentist with please don't hurt me eyes. She doesn't care. Dead gaze off into nothingness. Helps make it go faster I think. Straight up at the ceiling when they're doing stuff to my teeth. The light then regretted as I am blinded for a bit afterwards. Thousand yard stare at a wall unless talking to a hygienist. Straight at the cleavage. JK I can fall asleep in the chair. I stare deep into the dentist's soul to assert dominance. I look at the dentist, because she's friggin gorgeous. I close my eyes, the light is too strong to look anyway. Eyes closed, headphones in. Pretending I'm not there. Keeping those eyes closed light is too bright. I wear my dark sunglasses. It alleviates the issue. My dentist has a map of the world on their ceiling. 